So Warframe's Prime Resurgence is live right now. This is almost like I've said this somewhere else before already, right? It's almost like deja vu. Now for the next 10 weeks in Warframe, the Prime Vault is releasing 16 of our previously vaulted primed warframes, primed weapons, and of course, select accessories as well. Releasing them in combos of two warframes per week, complete with those weapons and of course, accessories. So Saren Prime and Mag Prime could be week one, and then it will rotate to Rhino Prime and Oberon the next week, and then it could rotate to a different combination of primed warframe and weapons the third week, and so on for that 10 week period. Some of these primes as well, it is worth noting, are being unvaulted for their very first time. So if you don't have those primed frames on weapons, now's the pair chance to get them however this is Varzia, a new vendor located on Maru's Bazaar, and they will be selling you relics that contain any of those primed parts on rotation that given week so anything for the warframes and weapons you can get off Varzia. there is a new resource on offer called Aya and it is farmable throughout those 10 week period Aya can be farmed on any mission where you would have normally farmed a relic. You'll get Aya instead of that relic. Once you get that Aya, you can then trade it to Varzia in return for whatever relic you want. One Aya is equal to one relic, so you can farm and select whatever relic you want simply by getting your hands on that Aya. So hopefully it might be a faster way to farm those primed warframes and weapons than the normal method we would have had in the past. However, after the first eight weeks, there is going to be a final two weeks where you will have a second chance to get any of the warframes and weapons that you might have missed during the start of the event during week one to week eight. So week one to week four is up for grabs again on week nine, everything from one to four. And everything from week five to week eight will show up again on week 10. So don't worry if you miss out on the first eight weeks, you will have that second chance to get them. The prime accessories, however, I believe the armor, cyan dandas and so on, are purchasable through Regal Aya, which is a currency much like platinum that you're going to be able to buy with real money. Now, the event will run, like I said, for 10 weeks. More than likely running into the new war at some point, hopefully, fingers crossed. 10 weeks to get your hands on as many primes as possible before they go back into the vault, providing they don't decide to change how the prime vault works from here on out. And it will be worth getting your hands on, I guess, more than one version of a certain prime or weapon because the prices will increase in trade chat once that vault closes again. So it will be a decent way for you to make a little bit of platinum. Now, like I said, 10 weeks, have fun, have a great day, and as always, thanks for watching. Until I